1 Peter chapter 2, verse 13. Submit yourselves to every ordinance of man for the Lord's sake, whether it be to the king as supreme, or unto governors as unto them who are sent by him for the punishment of evildoers, and for the praise of them that do well. For so is the will of God, that with well-doing you may put to silence the ignorance of foolish men. As free and not using your liberty for a cloak of maliciousness, but as the servants of God, honor all men, love the brotherhood, fear God, honor the king. So, Tom, what does this have to do with anything? Why are you reading out of First Peter? Well, <clears throat> back in Matthew, chapter 6, verse 34, it says, Don't worry about tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to have enough worry for itself. How do we trust that tomorrow's going to be okay? How do we stop from worrying everything? Well, this isn't the only spot in the Bible that it says for us to trust and honor the people and uh, officials, whether it be king, governor, boss, you know, anybody in our authority, pastors of our church. We have to trust them. And with that trust, much like we trust God, with that trust comes a, a freedom, a freedom of worry. Am I saying don't don't be aware, or don't be cautious? No, I'm not saying that. I'm saying to be free of that worry, to have that understanding that God is in control. Our leaders are put here by God. He said that in Romans, when Paul wrote to the Romans, um, that they were just the the Christians in Rome, and just like in in First Peter, the, the Christians in Turkey, they were under some some hard leaders, and the church didn't know how to handle that, and so they 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 wrote to them and told them to to honor to honor those that are in authority. Well, Tom, how is that relevant now? How is that Bible? Relevant to what we're doing right now. Well, if you look in Michigan here, um, there's a lot of political strain going on with with uh, organized uh, picketers down in the, the Capitol, with people not agreeing with what she's doing. Um, you know, we might not agree. We we might not all be on the same page, but what? we can be on is the same page of love. Understand, forgive, trust. Trust that through all this, God's grace, God's plan will be made known. Yeah, uh, God doesn't want us to serve uh, two masters. There's no way we can do that. We can't worry and also be uh, honoring God in, in all the duties that he, he has for us. So let's exercise a little bit of trust. Uh, take away a little bit of that worry, that, that burden off our backs. It's still relevant today, guys. This has been Tom from Biblical Chili, giving you guys a tool to help you walk the talk. Have a great day. I'll talk to you later.